Hi everybody. Somebody asked a question in the iClone forum about ways to make an item become invisible besides playing with the material of the opacity map. But I'm going to show you some fun things you can do with the opacity map. Let's just say you have your secret mission animated movie you're making and you want to, as a uh, wall disappears because it's hit by a magic spell, you want it to reveal something. So what we're going to do to do that is, <coughs> excuse me, we're going to take our box here, just show you in the scene, it's just a little box. Go over here to Modify tab, select your opacity material, and then click on UV reference. And you're going to get this little black look. I already had one open. But we'll just save this. And it's going to want to save as a bitmap. So make sure you save it as a PNG. And I'm just going to call this box UV. And I'm going to put it in my temp folder. There we go. Okay, now we're going to go over to my free site. This is pixeldatabase.net and I'm just going to select this box UV. I'm going to say hide pixels where oops total less than 20. You can actually just shorten that to hide. And that'll get rid of the black background. Now we're going to download this and we're going to just write over the same file. So now we've got an invisible black UV. So now what we're going to do is add another layer. This is paint.net. If you're rich and have Photoshop, you know how to do it in your app, I hope, because I don't. Okay, and now I'm just going to right click on this layer, and that'll give us all black again. And I'm going to push this down. And now what I want to do, the only reason I wanted this is so I can see where to write. And then now what we're going to do is we're going to get us a white font. So click on the text icon and then we're going to change our color. Swap that to we want white. And then we're going to pick some font that's kind of interesting looking. Let me grab a... Oh, I saw one that looked good. We'll just go with... That's fine. Okay. And all we want it to say is the safe... And I'll make this bigger so we can see it. That's too big. A safe combination is 24, 17, 63. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to hide the uh, little purple UV section so we don't need that. And now we're going to save this as our opacity map. So I'm going to just call this, uh, we'll call it safe code uh, opacity and make sure to change that back to a PNG because it wants to save it as a paint.net which has layers and I'm going to save that now we're going to go back over here and hit yes to flatten it and now we're going to go over to iClone I'm going to hit the opacity map okay but we don't want to show it at the beginning so on frame 0 you change the strength to zero and then we're going to go to frame 300 and we'll change it to let's say you have your whatever kind of particle wizard spell laser you point at it and then now the wall disappears and you're left with this and then you want to display this for say another five seconds so we'll go to frame 600 and on the modify tab go to display and turn it off so that'll actually hide it so if we play that back It'll start with your wall like this, and then as the wall fades away, it'll display. You can change the timing however fast you want that to go, but as the wall goes away, and then eventually the message. So that was just fun with opacity. You know, you can do whatever you want to do. That was my quick video, so and let me know what you think. Have a great day.